The David Peaston Foundation was created to educate and help others manage their health. Joining me now is Executive Director Marilyn Peaston. Welcome to the show, Marilyn. Well, thank you. Yes, I love this so much. So you are the wife of David Peaston, I right? am. the late singer, late and great, yes. St. Louis native. Yes. <laughs> and yes. you all started the David Peaston Foundation. Tell me why. We started in 2005. David always wanted, you know, after traveling all over the, over the world, he wanted to sing with his friends, you know, and he mm -hmm. had friends that sang other genres of music, mm -hmm. you know, like opera and stuff. So he wanted to create a concert that would have a focus of teaching people to appreciate all genres of music, not just uh, what he sang. Right. Yeah. So when you come to the Distinguished Gents, you will hear opera, jazz, gospel, classical, uh, music. You said country western too. Country western, <laughs> yes, most so definitely. So the D Distinguished Gents is a, is a benefit concert that you guys are having. It's a benefit up. concert, mm -hmm. yes. Um, the main cause is for people who have their primary care insurance is a state funded program. Mm -hmm. They don't get uh, physical or occupational therapy and with a prosthetic limb that is a horrible thing to do because without learning how to use that limb, chances of falling is pretty great could possibly lead to other injuries and further surgeries. So, so the David Peaston Foundation helps people who have prosthetic limbs because David himself suffered from having prosthetic limbs, correct? Yes, both legs were amputated. And so because he knew what it felt like to undergo that and the treatments and the bills and everything like that, mm -hmm. he wanted to give back and help others. Exactly. Right? Because exactly. Um, Medicare, you said, doesn't cover that. Right. It does not cover it. This is your primary care insurance. You just... You know, a prosthesis now will give you a wheelchair versus the prosthetic limbs. Mm -hmm. And you have to you have to learn how to basically live again with prosthetic limbs. Yeah, David described it as walking on stilts, learning to lean forward, mm -hmm. but not too far. Yeah. Yeah. And you told me before that falling is just a part. It's a part of your life. Now. Once you have a prosthetic limb. But the prosthesis, they will teach you how not to injure yourself, to to fall and not injure yourself. Mm -hmm. And so, how is how was it supporting him and the foundation? Supporting David, and yeah. it was great. Uh, you know, David got a chance to do something he loved to do, which was sing. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, it gave him the opportunity to support the community and bring awareness to we we don't really our talk health. about it that much. As and far to manage as, our health, exactly. Yes, I love that. Yes. And so the Distinguished Gents found the Distinguished Gents concert is coming up, and all genres of music will be there. And yes. who are some of your special guests? Our special guest is Shirley Murdoch. Love her. And yeah, she's an R&B legend. Yes. Yes. yes, but you know she's done gospel too. Mm -hmm. So. Uh, and she was just leaving at the opportunity to be a part of something that would help other people. Yeah, and her and David were friends, right? Yes, they were friends. They were very good friends. Shirley called, and she just had a feeling he wasn't doing well. And she said, how is he doing? I said, well, he's not doing well at all. And mm -hmm. she said, I'll be there tonight. And she was. She came in. David was in ICU. She sang for all the doctors and nurses and the other families that were waiting in the ICU. That's love right there. Yes. You know, I've read yes. a quote that says, the love you feel is directly in effect to the love you give. Yes. So clearly he was loved. Yes. Yeah. Yes. David had a lot of people who, uh, you know, I'm, I'm very blessed to have been a part of his life. Mm -hmm. too. And so. you all are just building and growing with the foundation. Yes, and, we are. And, this, and the concert that's coming up is a fundraiser so you can continue to grow it. Yes, yes, most definitely. You know, originally we started... Uh, with David, he always gave back to young artists, but then once he had the second leg amputated, we saw a gap in the insurance coverage that we needed to address, and he did, you know. I love that. I love yeah. that. So when we come back, we're going to talk more about the foundation, more okay. about the event, what people can expect to see, hear, feel, and everything. Okay. Uh, so stay with us right here on STL Live. We'll have more with the David Peterson Foundation right after this.